Thank you so much. Thank you, Nuna. Yes, I'm just working on the two nails. Sometimes I'm like doing a little bit to take time and step because I would like to um, make it more detailed for you ladies, just in case you're first time tuning in. Or for all beginners who would love to learn. Okay, so I'm using condensed glue gels again on this one. Close that one. And then no wipe top coat again. It feels so much better because after you're done, you don't have to go through your top coat and like go over the crystal. You do not want to do that because it's going to take away from the shines and the cuts of your crystals or your or any of the stones. Well, the frame and charm, you don't have to worry about it because it doesn't take away from the shines and it's actually it's protected. But with the crystal, we don't want to do that. And now I am going to using a cute oh, one of the shape that I have it. Um, let me find out what the name of it. So we have so many over like 300 different shape. Sometimes it feel like I'm feel excited, but also overwhelming to so many of them, which is great because we always want more. We don't want less. Great. And I have the frame right here. With the frames, it's really cool to create a lot of different look. And you will never go wrong with this. And this one a little bit longer. So I'm going to move my crystal just a bit down. Just using my other end, like dot tool, to move my brush, uh, to move my um, crystals without, like, affects any looks at all. Hey Brad, how are you? Looks great. I'm so obsessed with the frame and I did toe and tie. I've never wear my nails like this. Well, I did some frames up, but yesterday is one of the really cool set I got to share with you too. With it's all chan for foys. Actually my nails, I'm gonna show you in just a second when I have a little break between the nails gear. So it's all chan for foy and I did the shimmery coat on it. Just simple. And all ladies like leave it alone, Nancy. You don't need to add it more, right? Is that Nuna said or um or oh sorry. Great. And if you want to add anything on the side, you can. And I did only one beat, but if you want to do more than one, two, three, four, five, I think it looks great as well. Okay, great. So I am going to key it for 60 seconds. I'm so excited because we have a whole entire of another coming up with a giveaway for 40,000 giveaway, 40,000 follower giveaway, I'm sorry. And congratulations to our 30,000. I'm obviously so thrilled to see you receiving the package. And also, Sarah was announced a winner yesterday for her 5,000 follower giveaways. Congratulations to all the winners. Thank you so much for every single one of you. Uh, Zanita, Manzanita's, um, at the moment, we don't have an app to pay, but we, I think in, on the website, they accept the um, Visa cards, MasterCard, PayPal, and then app, um, Apple Pay. But at the moment, we don't have the app to pay yet. Thank you so much for even, like, mentioning it. They probably, I was, like, send the note to um, the office.
office and see if they have anything updated at all. He is the nails I were working yesterday. We did the frames. This one we did like all different frame and they stay really nice. I am so pleased with this because um, I'm like working a lot with my hands with three kids and busy. I can't like afford to have it catching on my hair all the time. And I have a long hair too. So then it just doesn't happen. It would keep catching, but I've been so happy. They feel, you feel texture of it, of course, because it has crystals and charms and bars and frames, everything in here. But I feel no catching at all. Like even we have a clients that feel not to, they're catching on something. If we're missing any spot, they're like, can I come in? Can you feel some more precision glue on it? It's just like I have one spot or two spots or whatever. I said, sure. And then it's gone like good for like three weeks when they come back. Beautiful designs. And I am going to using our one of our magic wand. And I am going to... Um, check it first you're gonna probably doing a little bit exam first like you don't need to squeeze it out yet just exam first and I feel right here scratchy the cracks right there I am squeeze just a little bit in right there just around the crystal you don't want to put it on the top and I'm promise with you like your clients will be so pleased with this and also so do you because then you don't have to worry about if the crystal is gonna coming off or it's gonna stay or she's gonna be happy, is keep catching, and one falling off, the other gonna falling off the next day. You know this, it will be stay on all the crystal up to four weeks. We have so many beautiful pictures that clients get it done, and then after four weeks, they're still on. Of course, their nails going out, but the crystal didn't go anywhere. All right, so I'm using again twin tip brush, and then I blend it all that the excess uh, precision glue gels out, so then that way it looks really nice after you key it. I am going to care for 60 seconds and this now will be completely done. I just always go one by one nails at a time. So then for all of you who is, um, you know, saw it from beginning, it's not going to be confused. We did two of them. It's really cool so far from the different shape that we had. Maya, when are you graduating? School. I'm so excited. Congratulations. Copy me, Bonnie. Bonnie. Hey, Bonnie. Thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, for new nail techs, advice for crystal placements. Is that you uh, general for crystal placements or for um for the works for the inspiration in the industry? So for crystal placements, you can you can give me a little bit more. So I would have I would love to give you some some shade advice. So I'm gonna wipe this off. So for crystal placements, uh, Bonnie, like is. It doesn't matter whatever you place a crystal on, place it like close tight together, you will never go wrong with this. It always come out beautiful and nice the way you want it. Looks cool. I had two of this. It's really stand out nice. And then the last one we have this. This one is so excited. And um here you go. 